So, I have already done a video on 5 creepiest ghost sightings caught on tape, but since there are so many clips out there, I have decided to make another one and will hopefully keep this an ongoing thing. As with all of my creepy and paranormal videos, hit those lights, sit back and enjoy. The Disneyland Ghost Disneyland Florida is one of the biggest tourist attractions in the world, and since its opening in 1955, there have been numerous reports of supposed paranormal activity. There has long been talk of the park being haunted by former workers, and some even say the ghost of Walt Disney has been spotted walking around. In 2009, a security camera may have caught evidence to back up these sightings, possibly proving that Disneyland is indeed haunted. This footage is believed to have captured a ghost walking through Disneyland's haunted mansion and also walking over water at the rivers of America. It was recorded after hours and the park was completely empty. Let's take a look. People say the apparition may be the result of reusing VHS surveillance tapes, but others strongly believe that it could be one of the many ghosts said to haunt Disneyland. What exactly was captured is still up for debate, and after being resurfaced on Reddit, the investigation as to what the figure was still has no answer. This next ghost video was recorded in around 1992 at 34 Barnby Place, West Yorkshire in the United Kingdom. The owner of the property was getting concerned about all kinds of hauntings and paranormal happenings, so he decided to set up video cameras in an attempt to capture what was responsible for the activity. Over a 10 year period, he began filming strange events in his home, but the footage he managed to capture of a figure in the bathroom is by far the best and clearest footage he caught. Take a look. The house was empty at the time, and what's even creepier is that after doing some research on the property, the owner found out that the street the house was built on was originally part of a graveyard. And if that isn't enough to stir up the paranormal, then the fact that 14 children burned to death in the 1940s in an old woolen mill just up the road would certainly explain the ghostly activity. People say that the technology of 1992 when this video was taken was nowhere near as good as it is today, meaning if it is a fake, it's a very good one. So what do you think? Was it a hoax, some sort of light reflection, or proof that ghosts are real? In my previous Ghost Caught on Camera video, I included a clip that showed orbs of light in a forest in Gettysburg, and after searching around, this next clip is easily one of the clearest orb videos out there. 
It was recorded in the early 1990s by Steve Lee at his haunted house deep in Colorado's Black Forest. Shortly after moving into the home, strange things began happening. Electrical devices would turn off randomly, unexplained orchestras and rattling chains could frequently be heard, and their children started reporting sightings of shadowy people and strange lights in their room. Steve decided to install cameras and motion sensors around the home to try and capture what was causing his family terror. It didn't take long before Steve captured some incredible footage of what his family had been witnessing. Take a look at these two clips showing strange bright orbs at the property. Since its release, the footage has become one of the most talked about examples of paranormal evidence ever captured, and video experts around the world have confirmed that the video hasn't been tampered with. Some say it could just be fireflies, but Steve has dismissed this, and he and his family remain convinced that the footage is proof of the paranormal activity that took place at their forest home. Stanley Palace Stanley Palace is a 16th century building located in Chester, England, it's renowned for its paranormal activity. Doors will slam with no explanation. The temperature is known to change dramatically and a mysterious lady can be heard singing around the property. As you can imagine, it's a popular place for paranormal groups. And during one investigation, the Sephron Paranormal Group managed to capture this terrifying footage. The team were completely shocked when they reviewed their videotapes and couldn't believe that three figures seemed to be looking down at them whilst they sat on the bottom of the stairs. They pointed out that the middle apparition looks very much like a face. The group believe that they have caught evidence of three children's ghosts who are thought to haunt the area. So are the three images simply car lights from a nearby road or proof that Stanley Palace is haunted? On a cold December day in 2003, Security cameras at London's Hampton Court Palace captured a strange video that to this day continues to shock experts. It all happened when security guards at Hampton Court kept finding a fire door open when no visitors were around. After checking the security tape, they were completely blown away by what they saw. Take a look. Some believe that the figure closely resembles King Henry VIII, who seized and later enlarged the palace in the 1500s. Although the footage does look too good to be true, Vicky Wood, who is a spokesperson for Hampton Court, said that she is completely baffled by it and that it is no joke. The security officer, James Forbes, has ruled out the theory that it could have been one of the estate workers dressed in a costume, as it has been confirmed that none of the workers own a costume like the one worn by the figure. He reported that it's incredibly spooky because the face just doesn't look human. The fact Hampton Court Palace have not sought publicity by promoting the palace as haunted leads many to think that they did indeed catch one of the best pieces of paranormal evidence ever. But what do you think of this mysterious figure? So that's five more creepy ghosts caught on camera. I want to keep making these top ghost sighting videos and as much as I love searching around for ghost clips, there are just so many out there. If you know of any really good clips, then let me know, and if there is enough information on it, then I can use it for a future video. As with all my ghost videos, I am not saying they are proof of the paranormal. I always leave that up to you, so you can come up with your own conclusions. But please be considerate when discussing your opinions in the comments. The amount of hate that is being written to others recently is not on. We don't need to argue. If everyone can accept each other's beliefs and just be civil with their discussions, then we can keep up a friendly comment section, which seems to be rare on YouTube nowadays. Thanks for watching and supporting my channel and see you next week for another video.